Welcome to another batch of Steam Next Fest videos. We're gonna be going and doing first looks on all of these. We're gonna go in. We know basically what we've gleaned off of the Steam page, perhaps maybe some, some parts of the discussion uh, area, if there's any discussion in there. Some of these are gonna be bigger, more popular games. This game, for example, Anno Mutationum, uh, which is uh, maybe a little confusing for some of you guys who play Anno, uh, like 1800 or 2105 or whatever. Uh, the other existing and very popular Anno series, it's a little confusing there. Uh, this is in no relation to that, to that series whatsoever. Uh, it is a 2.5D indie uh, action adventure RPG. We got all the tags in there. We're good. Let's get in and take a look. Uh, what I've, what I've, what I've uh, gathered from the uh, from the trailers, the game is very uh, cyberpunk, dramatic, uh, uh, and very cinematic. So we're gonna get probably lots of very cool. You know, takes on enough on pixel art. Oh, this 2.5D pixel art. It's like a mesh. Look at that. It's, like a, it's pretty cool. I love that there's like this almost flashback feel to this. If you guys remember flashback, except in in the flashback and outer out the outer worlds out. Uh, oh, there's another game that's very similar. Um, it, it's also a 2.5D, but the background matched the foreground, the pixel art, the very heavy, large, blocky pixel art uh, look. But this one, I mean, those are like, those look really great, those backgrounds. Like, they're just regular 3D levels. Uh, I see LTD scan for interactive objects. Let me see. Okay. I just showed you that. Okay. So I'll go over there and I got mail. Use computer. Mail. See, that I got more info on your illness. Get to my lab ASAP for a full examination. Auto reply. See, Ryan's auto reply. I'm busy. Don't talk to me for a while. And where have you been? I haven't seen you for a long time. Oh, okay. Girl, get a, get a clue. You don't want to talk. Lots more things. Let me see. Examine. Hmm, I thought of him while young. He had the same rebellious temperament as Ryan. Cool. Yeah, wow. I'm just aesthetically. This is really good. Just give me a few more days. You haven't paid rent in two months. Oh, dang it. What did she say at the end? Two more days. And then. Kapita. It's just three more days of process to pay. Mm, she's not gonna pay. Oh, view. Whoa. Okay, cool. I mean, I can't move this camera around at all, but I can see. I mean, those are all. Those are, look. Look at how we're looking down at at two D two D characters, <laughs> on a three D plane. <laughs> huh. I wonder if this is just to show us that that's this area we're gonna go to. I don't know. I can't move the camera. That'd be pretty sick if I could. Oh, what we got here? Dusty papers are pasted to the door in a chaotic fashion. We'll examine. Payment notice. Uh, let's see. Prosthetic limb of IO skin. Yes. No self payment. Relief credit. Okay. Oh, Fantasia Erotica imprint. Hey. All right. See, that's quite the list. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is, isn't it? Oh, there's another sheet. Oh, okay. Water soaked leaflet from a certain church. Most of content is illegible. Except for some words in the middle. Those who dance with the devil shall hold. A long spoon. Those who dance with the devil shall hold a long spoon. It's more bounty. Well, what the? Oh, this was this is the dang bulletin port. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's the community board basically. Uh, I was like, oh, is this somebody's like random door that's just going through all their paperwork? Uh, I said Steven Seagal at the bottom there. Uh, Steve Siegel. Uh, he sends right information and or help with his apprehension will be rewarded. Okay, Eric Markham, huh? Got it. And that's uh rip down the bounty. Oh, cool. Cool. Hey, I like that style of uh quest giving. It feels very organic. But let's listen. Move, you're getting in the way. <laughs> Do you think you're talking to oldie? Oldie? Are you looking for a fight, kid? Hey, me, get hit me and regret it for life. Hit me and say bye bye to your life. What the hell? Oh, you just saw your death war. Oh, you guys. You guys. Oh, what is. This? Okay, wait. Hold on a second. Hello? Oh. Oh, I'm, I'm talking to her. Oh, and I. I gotta talk to you in a bit. Hmm. Man over docs. Remember to communicate with me through the encrypted channel. That's right. That's right, guys. Encrypted channel. What is this? Oh, duh. Elevator button. I'm so dumb. Can I go through this one, anyways? I'm mashing other buttons, by the way. None of them seem to necessarily do anything. This is a very point-and-click adventure style of uh, of uh, intro. 
but I've seen the trailers. I know where it goes after this. There is some pretty, uh, pretty awesome combat uh, scenarios you get, you get yourself into. And that's what I'm here for. Let's go. Let's go. Although, I mean, like, this is pretty rad. <laughs> like, it is pretty rad. Squeeze a little extra story into my, uh, my hack and slash. We should find someone else. It's been a whole year. Just like, oh, it's not my girlfriend? Fucking dope. Doc weirdo. Is he still in an anti store basement in the back alley? We're just scamming another me mega corp. The Doc has a mind of its own. So my name is Ayani. What's with all these ghost people walking around? Um. Let's see. Hey, friend. What's your dream? You a journalist? Oh, you're one of those missionaries. Certainly. Our great father, pow father's power is infinite. Worship him and he will make our... Oh, gosh. Did one while he pay me a wage, too? That's right. Uh, if that's uh, what you wish, what is your expected salary? 40,000 credits. I'm a bioengineer. And a good day to you, heathen. Dang. Dang. Oh, that dude's a creeper. That dude's a creeper for sure. Hey, beauty. Don't you want to stay young forever? Oh, my God. It's like the song. Never any wrinkles. Never any worries. Don't go by the ball house. I have the, the right meta meds in tech right here. It's enhanced mechanic of mechanical virus. State of the art. Silence. Smart girl. I know. Not exactly legal, but hey. Beauty requires sacrifice, right? It's just gradual. Gradual to goblin, right? Oh, sorry. I was on a bit call. Did you make a noise? <laughs> Did you make noise? Dang. 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 Oh, hold up. I can interact with this, too? I am fucking broke. Holy shit. Trash bag. Can I interact with this? Hey, look at that. Wait, what? Christmas greetings. Sure, we'll take the <laughs> trash digger. Look at all, all of these things you can interact with. Um, the, okay, they're definitely making... Ooh. Greetings. We are currently not in business hours. Oh, okay. Okay, cool, cool. I'm just going to go through your trash real quick. Uh, and I'm going to take the, today's paper. Uh, and also this plant. It is dead for sure. Well, you know, I'm, it needs a new home. So, yeah, I'll see you later. People are just like preaching on the street. Oh, this is lovely. Like, Jess looks great. Okay. Oh, did you see me kick? Did you see me kick over that box? I was not expecting to be able to kick over a box in this world. <laughs> I thought everything was flat. Can I move this chair? Okay, 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 okay. You wowed me once, though. Fuck. Hello, anyone there? Who's talking? I've met with some trouble. And now I'm stuck. But that's not my fault. I'm innocent. <laughs> Can you maybe grab me a bite to eat? Like a sandwich or something? I'm just gonna every, every possible accent. <laughs> oh, that would be fantastic. I gotta go by. I mean, can I grab him a Coke and a smile or something? Jesus. Where's that box? It's still here. It's still here and I can still kick it. I won't be kicking every box in this game from now on. What's up, dude? Hi. See, better old go <laughs> better old cook goods and fine goods. Uh, sell me any junk you find. They're all treasure to me. Hold on a second. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Is he pissed? Dang. Alright. I'm trying I'm trying to walk here. Docks underground. Okay, so wait, hold on a second. Let me see. If I... I just want to point out that the way that he says his greeting, he has two so far that I've seen. Um, oh, so junk to him. Cool. Oh yeah, some little junk. Uh, and both of them have had sort of a, an accent to them that would match kind of a Saudi or some Saudi Arabia or some from the Middle East or something like that. And I just thought that was an interesting because I'm listening to the audio a little extra careful, a little extra closely now since I'm reading the reviews and comments saying that the audio is where it's uh, there's issues. Cool, as so I could get one dollar for all this stuff. That seems silly. Is there a sell all button? Um, I see sell, sell, sell. Okay, we'll just probably mash it, mash it, mash it, mash it. One credit, duh, 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 duh. one credit, duh, 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 duh. one credit. All right, a sell all button, which I probably clearly missed somewhere, would be great. 
I guess we'll have to wait till we get into um, combat before we see like you know, what the deal is with uh, with sound design. Because that was the biggest complaint I've seen on some of the older trailers. Let me see. Look at this place. Where all that money goes. Let's see. I'm just gonna, we're going to talk to the doctor now. Hold on a second. Can I interact with this? Okay. Now I'm just checking everything. Oh, like this large box. Whoa. Combines into a whole hand. Okay, oh, you have to take that? It's like from the Terminator or something? Trash bag, hold up. Crush tin. Man, this is, a, this is like a secret lab's trash bag. I feel like I should get more than that. Here we go. Upgrading security system cost me a fortune. Time for some more creative money, money lending. Look who finally dropped it! Just in time for testing the new system. I said you messaged days ago. It took so long. Been kind of busy lately. It's because your treatment has no effect whatsoever, Dr. Weirdstein. Weirdenstein. How long did it take mankind to eradicate the, me the Mechanica virus? Science takes time, patience, concepts, no doubt alien to you, teeny bob. Oh, are you kidding me? We're all virologists right now. Uh, let me see. Creative money lending about the new system, about the illness. Let's let's go. Let's go to. Um, uh, you know, let me say this. Um, I, I'm surprised if, if we don't actually see combat. Uh, it, you know, in, in, in some amount of time here, short amount of time, uh, then I will. Uh, I'll be wondering like if this is the best demonstration of this game because when you watch the trailers, the trailers gave me the impression of. Uh, uh, let me see about the system. Uh, that there was going to be kind of like an equal amount, but this is a pretty long prologue into uh, into anything. Most demos will just drop you right into the action, you know. Uh, see, so yeah, I was part of the points. The upgraded system treats your oh, entangleitis. That's right. Yeah, it's now a fully customized system just for you. Just from your previous records, uh, the your entangleitis seemed to be triggered at specific times. Whatever happens, I'll lose consciousness and hurt others. I'm getting a desperate. So, upgraded G ROM to collect your data and analyze the conditions in which it can be tri triggered. I'll start upgrading your combat suit. Prevent you from uh, taking. Here we go. Okay, so what he's saying is it's time to get into some combat and then actually like do something with it, right? <laughs> I need to see some. Let's go. Agree to do the test. Here it is. Combat. See, I knew it was coming up. I was. I was we're crossing that threshold where it's like, hmm. G prompt system. What is this? Examine. And then we're gonna read everything. You know, this is a lot. This is a lot. Like if the whole game. I mean, come on. If the whole game was like this. The bad levels like two missed calls. Like, dude, like, this, this is like uh, <clears throat> if uh, if they try to make like a Mass Effect, uh, uh, like a 2.5 D retro like side story kind of game or something. What is this thing? This is to help me with my entanglement problems. No matter what the research did. Oh dang, dog! Oh, here we go. Oh, this guy looks creepy. Oh, I've seen this in French. See, I uh, see Igor, the assistant. Connecting, please wait. <laughs> Put on my battle suit. There we go. There we go. I spoke too soon. Just a smidge too soon. Here we go. There we go. Here we go. Yeah. That's a battle suit? Doc? There's nothing but empty space. Doc? Coming. Oh, sorry, I was updating the local client. It's not quite finished loading. Just a sec. Hmm. I see. All right. I'm about to update the system. See new functions. Mm-hmm. A defense system. And now we have a comprehensive data collection. And I prepared a control panel for you. Great. Okay. Let's get started. Oh, I love this. I love this. Doc, your supercomputer is logging up. You know, some VO would be amazing in this game. Like, it seems VO would be amazing in this game. It's already been delayed. Like, it was supposed to come out this year sometime. Uh, and they kept pushing to the end of 2021. And it is now the end of 21. Yeah, of 2021. Cool. Here we go. Thing. Uh, yep, thank you. I know how to jump. <laughs> this is a very ham-fisted tutorial. Oh, man. 
This is to be slide, right? Jump, double jump, and slide or something. Double jump, and then, then be to dodge. Uh huh. <laughs> God, come on! Not everyone is. Not everyone has played a game like this before. That's not true. Come on, this is this, this is just a very hampered way of doing this. Oh, here we go. Can we just skip it? Ah, no, no, no. I need to enter the program stable. Oh, God, she tried so hard to save me. You don't watch any sudden crashes or reboots. That's right, yeah. No, I don't, I guess. Uh, oh, the, oh, the, um, hmm. So there's, there's a, a grab effect that happens. Oh, no. Oh, this part does not feel great. Um, so there is a... Like a, a, a grab effect that happens when you get close and you, you can see it it moves you over several frames um, And it feels like there's like a magnet range to that that is a bit broad and it happens almost every time you get close to the edge We're, We'll we'll keep playing with it. Of course uh, See what oh, we're shooting now But just I mean just just the jump itself doesn't feel great Yeah, yeah, we have no air control. We have actually have a little bit of air control. Yeah, we have a little bit of air control it just feels stiff for some reason. Um, oh, sorry. Who am I fighting here? But, uh, da, da, da. Okay, got it. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. I'm too busy, like, trying to <laughs> dissect it. Uh, X, X, up, X. Okay. Okay, X, X, up, X. Then X, X. Oh, B. Here we go. Ooh. See, this is sexy. Okay, this is sexy. You know when you're in here and you're and you're and you're like hacking and slashing him, them like this, like this feels pretty good. The jump just feels weird for some reason. There's also like a like a hitch when she lands. Oh gosh! Oh, combat backpack. Got it. Okay. Ooh, I like this too. Although I wish uh, I wish that was a little bit different. Well, what's right? Well, left trigger does what? Oh, complete. Okay, I see. It pulls up a menu. Yeah, I like my left trigger to be my uh, my pop up or even my. Oh, Got here. Ooh, that was a nice move. Which house do I get here? This is a, this part doesn't feel bad. It's you know it reaches the jump that really just is is just weird to me. But once you start like swinging, chaining things together like this, like then it's like okay, rad, you know. And then you come in and you do one of these numbers, and you're just like dang, oh gosh. See that's like almost right on the other side like this. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> I wonder if I unlock more moves. Or if it's a, um, uh, like a combo thing. I felt like I was doing something different each time, but probably not. Already, the, the word that I'm looking for for this game is, like, I mean, we'll see how this fight goes, is potential. Like, and that's probably a bad thing if a game is supposed to be close to release. Now, trial games and demo games are typically older builds. This is the build that they have in their gameplay trailer. Uh, except I didn't see that first that first uh, story element, story part. I'm glad they showed that because it is very cool. Do I have anything here? I don't. Okay. Wait, charges for how long? Okay, just about there. Spin an attack. Lots of. Oh. Might as well go ahead and use this. There's more damage to the head. No, it's about the same. I love that I get combo for that. What are you gonna do there? You gonna charge in? Oh, she's. The whole body is the hitbox. You just gotta get in there and just start, just start wailing on him. Oh, dang! A little moonwalk action there, guy. Oh, tail whip. Yeah. Yeah. This part feels feels fine. Like, especially if you consider how much of an RPG the game is. Or now that I now that I'm playing combat, I realize that yes, it is an RPG first. <laughs> oh, there's a range on this. I just noticed that. Dang it. Okay, so we're out of that. Do some 
work here. Watch his tail. Oh, oh, oh. What he's gonna do is good. He, he, gosh, you know it's funny. Like it probably looks like compression artifacts on on YouTube here. Uh oh. Oh, it's gonna do this whole like. Oh. Oh, our little boobies bounce. Oh, I appreciate that. Uh oh. So the game's looking a little. I mean, this trial is a little rough. Um, is so far. The, well, after the combat phase, the presentation of the big monster there, um, like this looks rad. Well, this looks amazing. Like all of this stuff, this story stuff is great. If you go on this thinking like, oh, cool, it's story, it's a story-based, uh, driven RPG, uh, with uh, with some combat elements, then awesome. But, uh, I went in thinking it would be the opposite, uh, and I hope that's what they intend. They intend as well because <laughs> it's like uh, this game called Faxanadu, right? Which was an uh, it was an old, old, old NES uh, NES uh, RPG side scroller type like uh, Zelda Two, uh, and it was just clunky. Clunky combat was clunky, but the RPG stuff was good. You know. <laughs> All right, here we go. Got kind of lost control again. Don't worry, it's just a test. You didn't cause any real trouble. Seems the intensity of the battle triggered the entangleitis. Uh, perhaps it was magnetic field resonance. Oh, okay, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's either one of those docs. Are you being serious? Yeah, are you serious? Break of progress. Well, incident was reported by Grom. Valuable data. That's right. Upload it just to your battle suit. Feel free to test it whenever. But now, now, because I'm busy. All right. So, uh, I, I reckon this is probably the end of the demo. Uh, we'll, we'll probably, oops, uh, go out here. Wait, let me in there? No, don't handle my research data again. Um, oh, cool. It's just basically sending you back in. It was amazing. Do you want to do it again? Oh. Well, what? Go back tomorrow. Yeah, how about this door that was right there? Jesus. <laughs> it was in front of the camera the whole time. Can I get this yet? Oh, look at that. A megabot chip. I see. I haven't heard from in ages. Please. I uh, got you covered, doll. So now security system in place. Going up. Ah, the damn door we came in. All right, guy. So now, uh, I know I have a quest twenty-seven meters. Oh, I was curious if I could wait. Did I actually interact with her too? No. Okay. Okay. This part of the store, this part of the game feels amazing. Like this is this is like groundbreaking to me. And frankly, I mean like so the sound is not the best. There's a lot of dryness to some some parts that I feel like should probably get a little bit more uh, maybe a little smoothed out or maybe a little more reverb or something something some way to kind of uh, coalesce the sounds together so they feel a little bit more like that glass breaking didn't really feel like it necessarily belonged there, and the cat meowing and the whooshing that just happened uh, in the left ear around that same time. Like there was, there's just there doesn't seem to be a synergy between them. Let's talk to this guy. Want to get high, that high, that hedge, that rainbow to the edge of the universe? Okay, you don't. Okay, fine. Move on now. All right. Let me see what's over here, and then... Oh! Hey, there we go! This guy. Hi! You here for the concert, too? I'm just passing by. Cool! I'm just passing by. I'm gonna use this for the course of my song. Okay. Well, cool. let's listen. Let's see. He saw the power hell! He is lost! He's no longer conscious. And uh, what is? What? Wow! 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 What's it? All right. Oh, hey, that's the same girl from the thing. Uh, with that creepy dude. I was falling. Oh, never mind. She's right here. Oh my God. <gasps> it's the same. It's the same. It's the same. It even got the bite in the front. What is going on? It's copy pasta. No, I'm kidding. Uh, all right. I think that's good. Uh, let's go over here to see. Is there something hidden back here? It's a ten out of ten. 
I found a very old book back here. Does that count? I guess so. 10 out of 10. My name is Mike VAK40. The game is called Anno Mutation M. This is the demo. You can check it out. Steam link will be down below. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, of course. And thank you so much for following and watching. Love you guys. Bye.